Today on the channel from Star Wars Episode 1 Collection, we've got Darth Sidious, we've got Yoda, we've got all kinds of fun. Welcome everyone, Kyle here, and welcome back to the channel for our daily Star Wars unboxings in 2021 and possibly beyond. And today, we've got the holographic Darth Sidious. You guys know I love a good hologram. And we've got Jedi Council Yoda. But remember, for all your Star Wars needs and a whole lot more, hit up Big Bad Toy Store. Link in the description below. But we're going to do these reviews like we do all the reviews on the channel. We're going to take a look at the packaging. We're going to talk about it. We're going to unbox it. We're going to talk about it. We're going to check out these ComTech chips, see what all the fuss is about, and see where we go from there. we got to go with Yoda first. Yoda, the green guy that stole all of our hearts at an early age and continues to steal our hearts with future generations of old Grogu, baby Yoda, in The Mandalorian. I love a good Yoda figure. Always have, always will, and I've never owned this one in the past. And I love the looks of this Jedi Council chair. I wish I had all the Jedi Council chairs for all the different Jedis out there. Uh, there was that Target box set that was sold many years ago. I never did have that. Uh, that is one of the, my few Star Wars regrets left at this point that I never picked up. That may be the Imperial Shuttle. Maybe one day. Playing that long, 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 long game on those. But maybe one day I'll get those. We'll see what happens. But there he is, old Yoda. Looking only like Yoda can look. Just looking like Yoda. But he's got his nice comfy chair. Sure does beat the uh, beaches of Dagobah. Dagobah, not so beautiful this time of year as you guys know. But this chair looks awfully comfy. Uh, it was the lazy boy of its day, I heard. Uh, we got a glamour shot of Yoda on the side there. You got his ComTech chip. Can't wait to hear what Yoda's up to. You got Darth Sidious up top. And the Star Wars logo, Episode 1, of course. And then on the back, what do we got? We got the usual. We got the old cross cell down below. We got more Jedi Master points coming my way. We got a bunch of warnings. All the other action figures there. Yoda, part of Collection 2. I, I would have said put him in Collection 1, but he got Collection 2. It is what it is. We got a little blurb as well. We got to read that about Yoda. See what it says. Let's see what it says about old Master Yoda. An esteemed Jedi Master, Yoda faithfully served the Galactic Republic as one of the 12 members of the Jedi Council. You know, he sure did. He sure did. So there he is. There's old Yoda. Looking only like he can look. It's funny how he looked older in Episode 1, kind of. But then you'd see him doing crazy stuff, you know, fighting in the other movies. We finally saw Yoda using his lightsaber skills. But this looks like an older Yoda than the Dagobah Yoda. I don't know. Maybe that's just my eyes. I don't know. That's how I see it, though. There it is. See you later, Yoda. Off to the side. See you later. Whoa, there we go. Plastic prison. His chair is bigger than him. That's how you know it's a good chair. Whenever you sit in a chair that's bigger than you, you know you're in for a good time. Most of the time. Not all the time, but most of the time. Uh, where's Yoda's glimmer stick or gimmer stick? See you later. They always talk about that gimmer stick. I don't know what a gimmer stick is, but I want one. But he does not have one here. But he's got some articulation. This is a pretty good Yoda. This looks more like uh, the, the Yoda from Spaceballs. And once again, old Kyle, never seen very many movies in his life. I've seen, seen bits and pieces of Spaceballs, but I've never seen the whole movie all the way through. Probably sacrilegious to a lot of you guys, but I've never seen a Tom Cruise movie. I've never seen a Back to the Future movie. Uh, I've never seen a ton of movies. I've just never had time for movies. I've always been about uh, sitcoms and comedies, uh, TV shows, Obviously, all the 80s animated series, I've seen every one of all those. Most TV shows, I've seen every episode ever of, of the good ones, we'll call it. But a lot of movies I never did watch uh, for whatever reason. I never saw Spaceballs, but it, this looks like, uh, yeah, what, what do they call him? What do they call him? It's not Yoda. I'm sure we'll, we'll figure it out, but I, I know exactly who it is. I'll put his little picture here, but that's what it looks like uh, more to me. It looks like that, so... I don't know, but still a really good looking Yoda. Doesn't have the real hair. Remember that Power of the Jedi unboxing we did that had the real hair Yoda? That was something. And we've had Yoda riding on a Kai Buck. We've had Yoda Jedi. We've had Old Man Yoda. We've had a lot of Yodas over the years. And this one, actually, I like it. I like the robe. I like the arm articulation. It's just not straight Power of the Force style. It does wing out and all that kind of stuff. A good look on Yoda here. A good smile on his face. Happier times for Yoda, of course. And he's got that Yoda articulation to sit down, and there he goes. He just really just sinks into that chair. Just sinks in for a good time watching his shows on TV. What more could you want on a Master Yoda? I don't think anything else. So I'm all I'm here all day for this one. I like this one a whole lot. Yoda looking good. 
No gimmer stick, no pot, no cane, no lightsaber, no real accessories except a big comfy chair. That's all he gets. Comtech chip time. Let's see what we got with Yoda. What's it say here? Jedi Master, member of the Jedi Council. He sure was. May the Force be with you. Go me the force. Hard to see the dark side is. Hard to see the dark side is. If you can't see at night, well, yeah, that's a true story. I'll feel you. What does that say? Fear leads to anger. Anger leads to hate. Hate leads to suffering. Boom, there you go. And we'll leave you with that. That's all you got from Yoda. So I like it. I like this one. This is actually one of my favorite Episode 1 figures we've unboxed so far. So if you got a chance to get this Yoda, I say pick him up all day long. Now we turn our attention to one of Yoda's biggest enemies if we had the old jedi force file cards here right now he'd be at the top of yoda's enemy list i'm guessing and that is old darth sidious holographic darth sidious so getting the most out of your molds here we're just get a little fresh coat of paint on here and now you got something totally different so there it is we'll see what that Comtech chip says we got the glamour shot you got darth darth maul up top on the back there it is. You got the cross cell, everything else we saw on Yoda, and then we got a little blurb we'll have to read about old holographic Darth Sidious. Don't people don't come to each other in hologram form as much as they used to. The evil and mysterious power behind the Trade Federation's blockade of Naboo, Darth Sidious appears over vast instances as a holograph in order to communicate orders to his many subordinates. So oh, he's he's got a, a weave of people out there. See you later. He's He's spider webbing across the galaxy. See you later. Up high. Uh, just spewing his hate. Spewing his hate. But there he is. I got so many holographic and transmission figures. See you later. Oh, and he is a sticky, disgusting, gross mess. As you'd expect. That seems the way the way it's going. This is identical to the last figure. We've already reviewed this. But this is a sticky mess. I'm getting him on this stand immediately. I, I'm not going to stand for this. No pun intended with a stand, but my goodness. This is like a half-melted half Jolly Rancher or Sucker. And like we always say, it's been left in the back seat of your car. It's 100 degrees out. It's 2,000 degrees inside your car. And this Jolly Rancher is slowly melting away into sticky disaster. And that's where Darth Sidious is here. So I'm going to use the packaging tape on overdrive, cleaning him up for sure. But not a lot to this one. It's the same figure we got before. If you had to choose between the two, you're definitely getting the regular version. But I guess, you know, he came in those movies a lot as a hologram. So I guess it does represent that. It does work for me. I just wish he wasn't so sticky. But it's the exact same figure as the previous one. But let's see what he says in the old Comtech. All right, let's see it. This is my apprentice, Darth Maul. He will find your lost ship. There you go. You gonna say anything else? And Queen Amidala, that's just like the kitty. Okay, one more. This is my apprentice, Darth Maul. He will find your lost ship. So Darth Sidious only getting two sayings here, unfortunately. But, you know, he, he doesn't need to speak a lot of words. His, his ugly face, his melting candle face, uh, does all the talking for him, I think. Uh, and his Force Lightning, of course. But there it is. The yin and yang, the greatest Jedi, the greatest uh, Sith Lord, I guess we'd ever say, of all time. So there they are. They're ready to go. They're back together once again. Yoda enjoying a comfy spot in his, his uh, nice comfy chair. And uh, Darth Sidious going via hologram. So interesting dynamic between these two but what do you think did you have these has he always been a sticky mess was he a sticky mess back in 1998 let me know in the comments below make sure you like this video make sure you subscribe to the channel turn the notification bells on of course uh, make sure you're following me and uh, all that fun stuff as we march towards 10,000 subscribers on the channel follow me on social media at surpaul64 on twitter the underscore kyle underscore peterson on instagram and of course pro wrestling tees.com search kyle peterson so for darth sidious and yoda I'm Kyle. See you guys all real soon.